get out of here. I told you to do it my way. Clark and Marshall at Ted Stevens. And you're responsible. Stevens? Yes, sir. Stevens. Boy with all the medals, the one-man army. Any details? No, sir. you alone. What's going on here? With Clark and Marshall. Clark and Marshall are dead. He's responsible. You're never going to make that stick. I'll make it stick. All right, Stevens. Saunders inside. Doc. Germans killed him. 
That's what happened. It was your fault, Stevens. That's your story. Look, Lieutenant. Lieutenant, I better change that bandage. It won't take very long. I'll take him in there, Doc. twice in action. Just why are you preferring charges? Disobeying a direct order. In what way? Lieutenant, I'd like him here face to face when I give you the details so there's no misunderstanding. How you doing, Doc? Come along, sir. Just be a few minutes. You knew Stevens before he joined the outfit this morning. Yes, sir, I did. It was D-Day.
I said move! Come on! He's my buddy. I gotta get him out of there. You try to make it back there. Those cross are gonna chop you down. Get this pinned under that jeep. He needs my help. Well, you can't give it to him. That's why I have to knock out the machine and the cinematics can get to him. He's bleeding! Where's that machine gun? Now you listen to me. You keep him busy. Keep their heads down. I'm gonna crawl up close and try to get in a grenade. I can't. I... Look, he needs my help. Then kill Krauts. Keep firing. Keep moving. Now give me cover! Give me cover! Got you, buddy. seen him before this morning? No, sir, it was a couple of months later. Just before we moved through a village by the name of, uh, what was it? It was, uh, it was Bazan, a village by the name of Bazan. The whole place was a mess. Heavy casualties. We were leaving the third platoon. I was looking for company headquarters. Roma, huh? Yeah. 
Hey, you've come a long way. You made sergeant, huh? Oh, yeah, I, uh, I got my first stripe right after I saw you. A bunch of us were surprised by a tank, and uh, I ran up and dumped a grenade down the turret. The CO was real impressed. Well, how'd you get the other two? Pillbox, night attack. Hey, come on, I'll, uh, I'll show you headquarters here. Well, my name is Saunders. Oh, Stevens. Guess you're a squad leader now, huh? Yeah, well, I had a squad. Uh, half of them were killed, and the, uh, the rest were uh, sent back wounded. You lost your whole squad. Uh, yeah. I... Well, I tried to teach him a little poem I learned at Omaha. Hey, the only way to keep alive is to kill crowds. Keep firing, keep moving. I tried to beat it into them, but they were fuck kids, you know. Uh, they get confused, model hesitate. <laughs> of the Germans here. We're taking him back for interrogation. Hey, let us! Take off! Come on! Take off! What's going on here? You out of your mind, Sergeant? The Captain, this uh, Sergeant, he just lost all his men when he... he see a prisoner where they got a little rattled. I can, I can take care of him. All right, Sergeant. But you'd better settle him down. Yes. Thank you. What's the matter with you? Lousy stinking crowd, you should let me kill him. What are you talking about? He's a prisoner. Well, we got rules now, huh? Keep moving, keep firing, remember, Sergeant? Yeah, yeah, I remember, but you gotta take it easy. Yeah, I'll take it easy. When I get to Berlin. Let me see. Yeah, I'll see you, Sergeant. Couldn't slow down. Couldn't get with it. Okay, Lieutenant. Been here pretty good, Lieutenant. Now, Saunders was just filling me in in the background about the time you two first met. <laughs> sure. He's got you convinced I'm a murderer, right? Sit down, soldier. bringing you up on charges, you don't have to say anything. Matter of fact, we go through channels, you have a right to demand defense counsel. I don't need any counsel, sir, because I didn't do anything. Now you go ahead, go on. Tell him whatever you want to. But you're making an awful big mistake. The only mistake I made was taking you on the mission in the first place. Yeah, sure. All right, quiet down. Quiet down. Now let's take it slow and easy. One at a time. Saunders. Yes, sir. Stevens started out wrong from the time he came here this morning. Only I didn't know how wrong until it was too late. Perhaps a shot, Ellen. Saunders, got a new replacement for your squad. The other two showed up yet? No, sir. Hey, Stevens, how are you? Pretty good. How are you, Saunders? 
You two know each other? Yes, sir. How you been? All right, you? Okay. Good. It's a nice surprise, Lieutenant, being in Saunders' squad. Good. You boys are going to have to start shaping up. The Italian tells me Stevens can wear the DSC and the Silver Star. Hey, you've got a real live hero amongst us, huh? Oh, yeah. Lieutenant Hanley. Hey, Clark, this is Marshall for your replacement, sir. Hi. Been on the line? Yes, sir. We've uh, had a little experience. Good. Had chow yet? I know, sir. Better grab some. You all better get some. We'll be pulling out soon. How many crowds you have to kill to get them kind of medals? They can count. Hey, I thought you swapped that off yesterday. Changed my mind. That's a big idea. Don't ever point a gun at me. It's empty, clown. Hey, Stevens, come on. A little edgy, ain't you? You want to die? Let him jam a gun in your back. All right? You developed a head trigger, haven't you? Well, I figured the side with the most hair triggers is going to win the war. Saunders. Here's the area to cover. Hill 308. It's heavily wooded. Every con hasn't been able to see much. I'll try and find out where the enemy is dug in. If you can pinpoint their positions, artillery can soften them up before we move it. Yes, sir. Now remember, this is a recon patrol. We want the information. We don't want the enemy to know we have it. Right. Okay, let's go saddle up. So if there might be some crowds wandering around in here, we don't want to spread out too much. You, uh, get more metals moving up front, Sarge. Didn't you know that? All right, knock it off, Clark. Let's go. With you. Who told you to open fire? This is a recon patrol. We're supposed to avoid a fight if we can. But they're all around us. They're bound to see us sooner or later, so I killed the crowd. So what? I'll make that decision. I'm still running the squad. One of them got away. He'll probably alert every crowd in this area. 
Only way to stay alive is to kill Krauts. Keep firing, keep moving. Omaha Beach, D-Day, remember, Sergeant? Now don't you tell me about D-Day. We had 50 feet of beach and the sea was behind us. And you were green, well, you're not so green anymore. That's right. I'm not green anymore. So I kill Krauts before they kill me, and I'm not standing around waiting for you guys to make up your minds. You're gonna stand around and wait until I tell you. You got it? You stay close to me. Real close where I can keep an eye on you. All right, let's go. Stevens, you and I seem to have started off all wrong. I didn't ask you before how you lost your stripes, but well, maybe it has something to do with it. I lost my stripes in a bar brawl over a French girl. But it doesn't make any difference because I don't miss swear. Why? Because stripes mean responsibility for other men's lives. That's why. You don't want that? No. And under me, I tried to shape them up. I tried to tell them what it was all about, but they got killed anyway. When you add it all up, every man's responsible for his own life. You understand? That kind of thinking got you the DSC and the Silver Star? Saunders, I did everything you told me to do. I... I didn't stop. I didn't think even. I just killed Germans as many and as fast as I could before they killed me. Now they want to hang medals on me, but... I couldn't care less. Sorry. Move out. side. <laughs> That's a neat trick. You dig in on the other side of the slope, makes it hard for the artillery. Clark, Marshal, move off to your left, see what their strength is. Mark the positions down on your map, make sure you're accurate. When battalion calls in for artillery, they will know exactly where to zero in. Will do. Kirby, little John, you move off to the right, you do the same thing. Four of you rendezvous back here in 20 minutes. 20 minutes. Cage, you move back. Keep an eye out. Stevens, we'll mark their positions down from here. Doc, you stay with us. Okay, move out. Stevens, we have some waiting to do.
machine guns about 300 yards due east all right well, well there's a mortar position right down at the bottom of the slope okay in the uh anything else nothing i can see getting back. Yeah, that, that's just way fine. Oh, yeah. Stella, sit out. Nice. Americana, ah. Fuck. Marshal, they're pinned down onto the bridge with a mission gun. Well, how are we going to get them out? We'll have to pin the crowds down. Cage, you and I will flank them from the left. Stevens, you get Kirby and Little John come up the other side. And you wait. Cage, you and I will rush them. Nobody fires until I do. Start. Good. 
Go off to Kirby Little John like you told him to. Clark and Marshall are dead. Marshall was wounded and he told them to run for it. They didn't have a chance. All right, give me my rifle. I told you to Kirby and Little John. I told you to do it my way. Clark and Marshall at Ted Stevens. And irresponsible. That's the way it happened, Lieutenant. Should have went off without a hitch, but Clark and Marshall are dead. Do you have anything to add to what Saunders said? Sure. See, he didn't tell the whole story. More Krauts could have arrived while I was out chasing down Little John and Kirby. Well, I made a decision, and I charged that machine gun. And there was no way for me to know that Marshall was wounded and couldn't move fast enough to get out of there. And you couldn't know it either. That's right, Stevens. I don't know Marshall was wounded. But my way, they wouldn't have had to make a run for it. Words. Saunders, can Cage fill me in on the patrol? Point out the positions? Yes, sir. All right, take my jeep back to Battalion HQ with Stevens. You could prefer charges there. Let's go, Stevens. I think you're all wrong about this. You're just upset because Clark and Marshall are dead. Look, you go through with this thing, they're going to nail me to the wall. You'll get a hearing. I, wait a minute. Listen, I, I, I didn't lose my stripes in any bar brawl. I lost him on the line. One of my men, he hung back during a charge. Well, I had to knock him around a little. He was going too slow. One careful step at a time. What's wrong with that? Cage. Lieutenant. Take us back to the time. Huh? Sure thing, sir. Thank 
do. Checkmate King 2, this is White Rip over. Checkmate King 2, checkmate King 2, this is White Rip over. This is King 2, over. We've been hit by an enemy patrol. The drivers that were pinned down, over. White Rook, what is your position, over? About a thousand yards south of you. We can use some help. What's happening, White Rook? White Rook, repeat, what is happening? Over. Stevens, we might have both got out. Kill crowds. Keep firing. Keep moving. Isn't that what you said? Lieutenant, I was taking him in to be caught marshal for charging a gun against orders. Now I owe my life to him for fighting this kind of a fight. How do you figure it? You don't. That's the hard part. Come on, let's go. 